growing up on the East Coast, I truthfully didn't know about conversion therapy, or I'd heard about it, but I didn't realize how it was so rampant in our country and in the world. This was a conversation about love and understanding and, and to see the journey of what happens in this family of Garrett's story, um, I felt was so important, not only for the LGBTQ community, but for our country, like to, we need to be having conversations. We're really hoping that it inspires others to find their true selves and to find their own acceptance of themselves so that they can, um, you know, find a better life or find a life that they wish to, to lead. Russell brought, he made it his own. He made, um, the character of Marshall his own and did it so beautifully and but he really honored the truth of Herschel's um, beliefs and and that that's all that's all Herschel wanted and that's all we wanted. From the second Nicole showed up on set she cared so much about this film and the message that we're telling and it was almost this like beautiful transition, you know, she was so passionate. Cameron has parents that exercised him, you know, and rebaptized him and won't accept him being gay. And Jared has a mother who fights to take him out of there. Um, that is what's going on. You know, that's the duality of LGBTQ youth in our country. And we really want to shine a light on the kids who don't have that support. Lucas embodies this boyish innocence slashed with goofiness. And um, he is just a you know, pure heart, like he, he's just a wonderful um, young man. And um, I had just seen Manchester by the Sea and already just was enamored by his talent and, and obviously had known of him. Um, but there's a, there's a boyish innocence about Lucas and, and that really marries up very well with, with Garrett Conley. I hope that, that people see our film and understand what we're trying to do and, and the message that we're trying to tell. Um, it's important um, because we need, we need these therapies to end and we need more conversation about, outside of even just therapies, but just about acceptance. We need those conversations to, to occur and we're hoping to inspire. I mean, so many people have come up to us already crying and, and really being affected by the movie. And we would just look at each other and say, well, that's all that matters, truthfully. Most important was Garrett. You know, we wanted to make sure we were telling his story in a truthful way. And we wanted to make sure that he was proud of the message that we were telling. We weren't how we weren't trying to fictionalize his life. We weren't trying to change anything. Um, we wanted him to feel the utmost trust.